let's discuss another important element of planning a writing course which is how to give feedback and what kind of methods of feedback are there which are supported by the relevant research so it's important that the teacher plays important role in terms of finding out errors and it's it's important to point out that the teachers don't uh you know point out errors too much because that might affect student self esteem and motivation and that might bring in the elements of fear or apprehensions so it's important that the teacher indicates the kinds or nature of errors by nature of errors i mean the global or uh, local by global i mean overall structure organization introduction the provision of conclusion and by local i mean the syntactic and uh, grammatical or um, other mechanical errors and in this regard the teacher plays important role in terms of making suggestions to the students suggestions which are useful which they can carry forward suggestions which are uh, sort of like a feed for feed feed forward for them which engages them which influences them to reflect critically on their learning and uh, take out uh, the important message given in the feedback so by if if a teacher for example happens to rewrite the whole passages that might affect student self esteem identity and motivation that might have a damaging impact on them and that might them make think twice before writing anything or presenting it to the teacher so the balanced way to give feedback is to offer students some viable strategies how to improve how to uh, refine their piece of writing and uh, another important strategy is to ask students questions for example you a teacher can as you as language teachers can ask students this is very interesting introduction what about including example here so in this way teacher makes feedback personalized which is emotive which gives students a uh, sort of sympathy encouragement confidence and a trigger to go on so teacher's role is as i said before is is has to be recognized in a balanced way like it's not only to criticize but also to praise and praise in such a way which motivates students to do more which indeed helps them find the gaps between the current and the desired performance so another important element of feedback is to encourage students think critically reflect upon their learning and see what they are meant to do next i mean what they want to do with the uh, with the piece of writing they have produced and it's also encourages uh, the teacher encourages students to engage in conferences where feedback is offered discussed interpreted and where decisions are made regarding the future course of action